Alright, we're definitely taking Chorus of the Dead, y'all already know. So it's the same four abilities, right? Yes, okay. Um, upper Reaches is kind of really easy. And I'm gonna do this run a little bit different than the other one. I just did a run with this, uh, this ability thing that we got going on here. This dead soul. <clears throat> I'm just gonna see how quickly we get through these things. Um, don't think this is the way you should. working slightly okay I don't have a pet I realize that would really help now let's go oh he gets the bubble too that's nice I just turned that <coughs> Yeah, yeah, my pet helps a lot. I'm gonna try to zerg this. Again, this is only a four. We're on upper reaches for this one, so. But what does suck is most of the abilities that you get for this, what is this thing called? Dead Soul. Um, they're really OP, the more you can get, but We'll take what we can. Phase shift increases. That's not what we wanted, but we'll take it. That's one of the dead ones. We have a teleporting ability, so we're going to try to utilize that to skip as much as possible. Okay, so I'd rather this one on the right, which is Shifting Sustances, uh, because the Arcane's Feasting uh, is more group-oriented. Speed boost, speed boost, speed boost. Yes, I escaped that. There's no difference between each run. It's just the more powers you can get, you can really make this thing absolutely stupidly OP, that's for sure. <clears throat> like, you can get infinite healing, pretty much. You can reduce the cooldown on Wailing Blast, pretty much zero. The damage, of course, gets increased. Anytime you assume the form of return, uh, I'll increase the radius. I'm not going to be going in and out of forms.
Whoops. I'm not even going to buy anything out of this one, this one. Um, my souls, flesh pack. They're all dead. We'll just take that one. They're all dead abilities for this. Which way is it? There's two ways that this floor can be. It's that way, okay. Take him down. I'm still on the eight second. I got it down to two seconds on my last run. I got an eight second cooldown on this freaking thing. <clears throat> If you guys want to see a really OP Dead Souls, I strongly suggest you check out the actual video for this event. You'll find it in our World of Warcraft playlist. Or just go ahead and check out our Cold Heart Interstitia Layer 5 run. And uh, yeah, that was in that one as well. So you'll see it in two different videos. And it, it was freaking god mode with this. I was just running around, just spamming this mode, everything was just dead. Um. Under attack damage. Yep, let's go. We're in layer of four or five, sorry. Oof, that did not work. Fuck it, let's go and kill him. This is why I love upper reaches, is how fast it is to get through these guys. Should have assumed. Increase the maximum number of charges of twisting shadows by two, which is cooldown. That would be that. While uh, part your auto attack is increased, it's like that. You can probably guess what key is getting smacked right now. 
Post down below in the comment section which keys get in this match. I can't die. It's just dumb. <laughs> and I just do so. It, the damage isn't bad. I would do more damage as my warlock, but. I'll trade in not being able to die for this. I out heal for the amount of damage they do. I got no good abilities in this one at all though. From the I know I didn't get that many anima powers, but still. Like holy crap, that was poor. See if we can pick up any good wins. That's that's the best one you're gonna get, Kachi. That was the best one. Two heals now. Let's see if we can take off Sanod. One of the cooler looking beans from this. I didn't get the dot. That's what was important. So there's a dot that you can get from Wailing Blast. And you can stack that shit up to five and it just. I got it to 7,500 damage every two seconds. It was OP as hell. The issue is my pet's about to die. But we're gonna see how good we can survive without him. Got two charges of phase ship with a couple of healing abilities in the background. I'm rotating my healing from that right now. Every six seconds I'm applying it, so I do what do. I out heal the amount of damage he does. I do want my pet though. This is getting kind of lame. Go. Oof, I just applied that twice. So I'm OP as hell right now. I'm about to just heal the max in a bit. Takes a lot longer to kill him, but I can't die. So like I said, I'll take that extra time to just be able to leave. Without having to do anything except spam my 2 key. Easy clap. 